I'm Sabrina with the two minute CRA news you need to know. A lot of you had a very strong reaction to a bill that aims to sever relationships between schools and restaurants and schools and grocery stores. Proponents argued that food based school fundraisers like candy sales contribute to childhood obesity. So here's an update on the bill. AB 841 has been modified. There's good and bad news here. The bill still bans on campus incentive programs like rewarding kids with small personal pizza for their achievements in school. But the good news is the modified bill does allow off campus school fundraisers that are food based. That change is thanks to CRA and other groups pushing for fixes to this bill. The CRA went from opposing this to now being neutral. We'll see what the governor does with it. Now to another topic, restrictive scheduling. There's been a huge push by local and state government to require employers to provide as much as 28 days notice on employee schedules. But these proposals come with restrictions and penalties that can make it much harder for managers to provide flexible schedules and the option to swap shifts. And in restaurants, a flexible schedule is a big perk of the job. Well, not surprisingly, a new Gallup poll says that 67% of people working variable hours say their schedule doesn't cause a financial hardship, and a solid majority say they're satisfied with the hours they work weekly. The CRA has worked tirelessly for the last two years to help keep scheduling fair for everyone. The employees looking for the flexibility and the employers trying to run their business. Businesses. We hear it all the time. Good employees are hard to find, and young people who come in to apply for a job aren't prepared. So let's fix that. Sign up to be a volunteer for Force in Training, or FIT, on October 24th. FIT uses industry volunteers to prepare high school culinary arts students for their first job. Everything from how to apply for a job to how to be a good employee to career paths within the restaurant industry. Last year, industry volunteers prepared 3,000 students for their first job. Space is limited, so register today at calrestfoundation.org slash FIT. That's our two minutes. I'm Sabrina. Thank you for watching.